Oh, so things are good at home. Things are real good at home, me and my wife. You know what we bicker about? Picking a restaurant with my wife. I don't know if it's because she's from Manhattan and there's so many, you know. She always asks me what I want. She goes, what, what do you want to eat? I go, uh, I go, let's get some Thai food. Here's my wife. No. No. I can't, I can't have Thai food today. I had Thai food yesterday. I go, oh. Well, people in Thailand handle that pretty well, you know. <laughs> Now, the food inside the house is getting a little more exotic, too. We don't have rice, so she banished rice, replaced it with quinoa. <laughs> yeah. She I was at the grocery store. She texted me to get... So I'm asking, hey, what aisle is quinoa? Where do I find the... <laughs> quinoa. I don't know if everyone's had quinoa. Quinoa's good. Quinoa's good if you put it in something that was already good. <laughs> No one's ever been eating some random dish of food going, uh, this is a little bland, but I think a little quinoa would bring it out, you know? <laughs> so everything, and my wife's in charge of the food. Everything's organic too. We have organic peanut butter. Does anyone in the room have a beagle? <laughs> I have a theory, even a beagle won't eat organic peanut butter. Even a beagle. <laughs> Stuff's tough, man. If you've never had organic peanut butter, you can make it yourself. You don't need to go buy it. Here's how you make organic peanut butter. Just get out your regular peanut butter. Your regular peanut butter. And then pour oil on top of it. <laughs> and then somehow remove all the peanut butter flavor. I don't know how to do that. Oh, <laughs> well, here's the final step. This is crucial, the final step. Take a $20 bill and drop that in the garbage right there. <laughs> Peter, uh, there you go. All right. But my wife's getting a little crazy with her diet. I'm getting worried about it. She gets on the internet. She's always looking for the next trend, you know? But she doesn't challenge anything. Here's what she told me one time. She goes, hey, we're not supposed to be drinking milk as adults because we're the only species that does that. I go, hon, we're the only species that can milk cows. That's part of the puzzle. <laughs> Squirrels would love to have some ice cream from time to time. But they're undisciplined. <laughs> and with a... right. Thank you, buddy. Thank you. Hey, the, milk... All right. the milk lobby has got my back right there. There we go. <laughs> Oh, yeah.